and Lila from Colorado Backyard Farms. Today we are talking about how to create garden planters. You will need gloves, pruners, trowels, your plants, a container, and potting soil. Garden planters are a great option because they're perfect for pretty much any setting since there are so many options to choose from. Visit your local nursery to see their options or look online to see what you can find there, finding your perfect planter for your location. While at your nursery, pick up your organic plants and organic soil as well. The most important thing to keep in mind is the amount of sun exposure your planters will receive. Also take into consideration wind and water exposure as well. Any reputable nursery can walk you through which plants will do best in, in your position or else you can always refer to the tags placed in each plant or the seed packets. Once you have purchased your planters, plants, and soil, it's time to head home and get dirty. Now check the bottom of your container, making sure there are holes in the bottom of your container for proper drainage. If there are no holes, flip your container over, take a drill, and drill a few holes in the bottom to ensure proper drainage for your plants. Fill your planter about half full of soil, then add enough water to make the soil damp. Now continue to add soil with water until your planter is about an inch full from the top. Decide on your preferred plant arrangement. You can get as creative as you'd like or else general rule, we start with the tallest plant in the center and then go out from there. So smaller plants and then cascading plants over the side of the planter. Once planted, give the pot a good drink. Again, refer to your plant tags to determine how much water and how often you'll need to water. Enjoy watching your hard work bloom. This is Lila Scott and Zoe Wood with Colorado Backyard Farms discussing how to create a garden planter. Hey.